a stick or a shed? That's a shed. Oh my god, it's a tiny elk antler. <laughs> oh my god. So cute. Alrighty, everybody, welcome to the Hunter Classic once again. We are out here on Whiteheart Island. We will be mostly focusing on turkey as I have entered in a turkey competition that ends in about three and a half hours. It is just past 11 p.m. Central Time, and the competition ends at 2 a.m., so I've got just under three hours. We will just... The only goal is to get a turkey that can get me on the board as somebody who has participated. I've looked at the scores of the top five right now. I don't really think we're going to get up that high, but you never know. I'm just happy to be here, happy to participate. With that, let's get this hunt started and get ourselves a big tom. What a stick. Wait, that's another antler. <laughs> I haven't made it. I don't think I've even made it a quarter mile since I picked up the last one. Do you see it? Here's a mushroom. Just a common one, but still a mushroom. 21 grams. Not bad. Oh, would you look at that? Another mushroom. 27 grams. A little bit bigger. Well, we're about 30 minutes in on this hunt. I've got a turkey called fairly nearby here in the woods. I'm gonna sneak up to this tree, hopefully, and we'll be able to hear it or see it before it hears or sees us. Do you see it? Well, at least it's a male. Alright, let's get the shotgun loaded. And then I will check back in with you when we are about to get it. Alrighty. He's snuck in a good bit closer now. I'm just gonna... Wait for an opportunity of him popping his head up between the trees here. And we'll have our first Tom down for the competition. I guess there was a second one. That's alright. get us on the board. Common male, 42.33. Position number six, not bad. Still aiming to get down to this lake. Alrighty, we are headed south of that field. Definitely got at least one turkey down here. Do you see it? There's a tom down there. <clears throat> like him to turn back towards me. There's another turkey. Look at him. This one seems determined to keep walking away from me, but I might be able to sneak up to the second one with a bow. We'll see. I can hear him. Alrighty. I think I've made up my mind. I think I'm gonna go after this first one with the bow. And 
like, kind of chase him down. And then use the shotgun on the other one. <sighs> I hit it. scores. 27. A lot smaller than the other guy. Alrighty. See if we can't get this other Tom and then move on and get closer to that lake I'm trying to get to. I think. Yeah, that's him. Alrighty, let's pick this guy up. Perfect. And onward we go with the rest of the hunt. Well, I made it to the lake. I haven't seen any turkeys, but I did get one to call up here real close by. Hopefully. I think I see him. Oh, there he is. Turkey tracks. Those aren't turkey tracks. Busted. The whole hunt's over, basically. I feel like I'm hearing something closer. Like, there's gotta be something much closer than that one. Over here, right? for sure. Oh, definitely. It's definitely over here. Aha! I see you. You're done. Tuck in, sit tight, and see if we can't call something else up here. Oh, there's one. Coming down the roadway. Looks like another head. Gotta wait till she gets a lot closer, but at least there's another turkey on the way in. This hen has been walking in real slow, but I think we got a gobble from a tom. I think. It is. <sighs> well, 
We have one male down. And one female down. But after I pick this guy up, I think I'm gonna move to a new location. I'm gonna stick with roads though. They seem to be the easiest to hunt. Bigger one. And a turkey. We'll get back up on the road and call. I also want to spot this elk. <laughs> He's so little. see two turkeys coming in. Back one's for sure a tom. There's, there's a hen. There's a tom. I have three toms coming in. If I had like a multi-shot shotgun, I might be able to get more than one. But we're a little limited. I think I'm just gonna make the best of the situation. Try and take the close ones with the bow and see if I can get the back one with the shotgun. Just depending on when and how they spook. There's more. So I'm just gonna try and stay on this edge. Make sure my camo's still good. Get to this tree. selection of toms coming in. Because I've got these two over here. One there. I lost track. There's two of them over that way. Maybe that's the other one. That's a rose belt. There's the other one. There's one there. And there's two more over here. There's the two. Make sure my camo's good. But I think I'm just gonna settle back in until these guys move in a little closer.
Here's hoping. That's just a female. There is a Tom out there. Here's hoping they'll come over here. Let's pick up this Tom. Position number two. God dang. That's a big turkey. I don't know if they're scored by weight or anything else, but like, dang, that's a big turkey. Beer. Tom. He's moving away from us though. We have already spooked him off. I attach myself to this tree. Here, I'm good. I think we'll try for one, maybe two more, and then we'll call it good. I'm very happy with position number two. I feel like the hens always come in way faster than they probably should. Of course, there's a tom behind him, too. She flopped over. That Tom is still there, though. Yeah, he's still coming in. him with the 12 gauge if he comes down the road line. Like right here. Of course he's gonna dip down where I can't see him. Alrighty, and with that, I think we're going to end the video here. We've gotten ourselves a good handful of turkey with this hunt. We've placed second as of right now. The competition does have just over two hours left in it. I'm going to leave it there. I'm pretty satisfied with that turkey that we did get. But if you enjoyed your time here watching the video, make sure you like, subscribe, leave a comment. Let me know how you feel about it. And with that, I will leave you here. And I hope you all have a wonderful rest of your day. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.